Hi beautiful souls, what I wish to share today with you is that there's so much information out there these days, there's information being bombarded to everybody from all of these different channels and applications and courses and books and papers and articles and radio stations and blah 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 blah, there's information overload. And it's not just information overload here on the earth plane because everything is always reflecting in other ways. But there's also an incredible amount of information being literally blasted at us through the sun. And, you know, this is filtered through the sun. It's obviously coming from source. And this can sometimes make us feel a little bit out of balance because, you know, taking all of this stuff in um, requires processing. And so this is why it's always so very vital to take care of your optic nerve about what you are placing your focus and your attention on, what you're looking at, because you have to process whatever you look at. And if you're also having to process extreme energy coming in through the sun and this now, then you also have to process that too. And I've noticed that there's a lot of us that are going through a little bit of wobble in our emotional system, and trying to keep that stabilized and balanced and keep it within our inner power can sometimes be you know a constant like riding a, a bucking bronco you really do have to uh, concentrate and focus during this period of um, acceleration and quickening because whether you can feel it or not whether you can feel it or not on an energetic level you certainly probably can look around in your life and feel it in what's going on around you things are fast things are coming in quick so be very, very intentional in every single moment of your day, in how you are focusing your energy and how you are also allowing that energy to process through your body because the body is literally uh, a series of processes. It really is, it's a series of processes. And to hold the maximum amount of light, you have to be able to release all of the stuff that is no longer serving you as it's kind of like a massive toroidal field entirely all the time like processing 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 next layer of light next layer of light next layer of light more light more light more love more love release let go release let go so my invitation today is to just go out into nature it's always good to go out into nature and just consider what it is that you're focusing on right now really make today a masterpiece make every single aspect of your day a masterpiece it doesn't have to be perfect but a masterpiece and then nonetheless you know focus where am I going to place my energy today where am I placing my my vision where am I placing my intention where am I placing my attention what do I wish to create and if you stay within these perimeters of focused in love and in service for the collective, for God, for life here on this beautiful planet and throughout the universe, bringing forth highest solutions for all and love, then you will thrive. You seriously will flourish because you'll feel good in yourself. And when we feel sort of out of balance and everything else, we're not handling the light, and we're not handling the information that's coming to us as and when it occurs. So we have to be able to let go of those things that aren't serving us. So don't look into the areas that don't serve you. Don't look into things that bring your energy down. If you're focusing on creating something really wonderful, focus in that area. Concentrate. Concentrate and make sure that you clear yourself down throughout the day regularly because the energy really is that strong. Don't allow yourself to be wiped out tired, stressed out or anything like that to keep your emotional body calm, relaxed, your mental body calm, relaxed, your physical body calm, relaxed, your spiritual body calm, relaxed, your etheric, your consciousness peaceful, relaxed, calm, serene, all is well, all is good, everybody has the power to do this. Bless you all, big love, my name is Zaza and I wish you all bountiful blessings and peace and joy in your path.